President John F. Kennedy and the Moon Speeches, Hidden Reason. On September 12, 1962, President John F. Kennedy delivered his historic speech at Rice University, boldly declaring, we choose to go to the moon in this decade. The ambition captured the world's imagination. However, a lesser known anecdote reveals a much more pragmatic and perhaps more brilliant reason behind this seemingly impossible goal. At the time, the U.S. was lagging dangerously behind the Soviet Union in the space race. The Soviets had launched Sputnik and sent the first man, Yuri Gagarin, into space. Kennedy needed a mission so audacious, so complex, and so publicly visible that it would require a massive, centralized effort. He wasn't just aiming for the moon. He was aiming to create an insurmountable lead in aerospace technology, materials, science, and computing. The real genius of the moonshot was that it was a goalpost mission. It was a single, defined objective that would force the development of thousands of new technologies. It would require unprecedented collaboration between government, academia, and industry. Kennedy knew that by focusing the nation's entire technological might on this one goal, the U.S. wouldn't just win a race to the moon, it would achieve a generational advantage in science and engineering. That would secure its geopolitical dominance for decades to come. The moon was the destination, but the real prize was the technological revolution required to get there.